Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Rita. So today we have a another very exciting video. It seemed like you guys really enjoyed my last coach video, so I thought I might as well just film another one for you. This is a purse that you can still buy. You can still get this handbag. It's going to be a little bit harder because it's no longer being produced, but there's a lot of, you know, off market, I guess. You can still get it, which is what I did for my case. I did get this purse in a reseller's um, website just because I couldn't find it anymore online. I believe Dillard's will still have it. So I'll definitely link it down below if I find it. But before we get into the video, I would really appreciate it if you decide to subscribe to my channel. All you need to do is click down here on that little red button, subscribe, and then you won't miss any of my upcoming ones. So let's get right into showing you this beautiful new purse. As you can tell, it's pretty small, but it does pack a punch. I was surprised. I've already used it. And I am talking about the beautiful tabby top handle. I believe this is going to be the 19. I'm not entirely sure. I'll definitely leave the information down below, but this is such a stunner. So this beautiful tabby is going to be in the chalk shade. So Coach has this kind of like off-white shade, which is the most adorable shade. I don't particularly like starky white purses. I feel like they're a little more high maintenance and a little bit harder to kind of like mix and match with things but like an off-white I feel like it just goes with everything especially with my wardrobe I feel like I have a lot of you know most of my things like this dress that I'm wearing would be beautiful with this purse so let's just get into the purse real quick this is going to be the tabby top handle it comes with of course the top handle the back also comes with a big opening which is where I would put in my phone since this is a smaller size purse, kind of like white wise, it would have to just go up there. It does look a little funny, so I'm still kind of like trying to figure out how I'm gonna, you know, carry this because you can see it if you put your phone like that upright. My phone is pretty big. This is the S20 Samsung Galaxy. So anyway, you do get that opening for whatever you might need it. Usually on coaches, I realize that I like to put my phone in this back little uh, pocket. It does come with the beautiful gold, or they're called really brass feet. And then it comes also with the ever so popular dog tag. I believe these are called dog tags. And all of the brass uh, hardware is going to have like the coach uh, logo on it. So it says coach on both sides for the two of this. And it does come with a longer strap. I'll go get it in a minute for the mud shots because uh, you can also carry this as the top handle, which would be this way. I'll show you real quick, which is this way. This is actually my preferred way, but it does come with the long strap, so you can just do a crossbody or on your shoulder. I'll get the strap in a second. First, I kind of like wanna show you the purse itself. So it does come in the beautiful Napa leather, which is the more smooth leather, but not as delicate as others they carry. And it does have the, um, the pebbled leather here so you do get both leather so the pebbled and then the napa very smooth beautiful leather and you get the big uh, brass c on the front and this tabby is going to be opened in a different way so it does have you can probably tell right there it does have a little uh button basically that you click you can see it better that way and you open it up so to close it it's gonna be harder because it's empty but you kind of like hurt right there so you just press it and it, it closes. And then to open it, you just kind of like push it and there you go. The inside is gonna be the same beautiful microfiber. This is in a darker, almost brown shade. And getting into the purse, let me take out, they come with very well packaged. The girl that I bought it from absolutely packaged this beautifully. So again, it didn't come from Coach directly. Like, it was just like a girl that bought it and she was reselling it. And she did a great job packing it for me. So anyway, um, it does have three different, two compartments and this also third pocket, if you can consider it like another compartment. It does also come with a small zipper, very, very tiny. So let me show you real quick. So that's a teeny tiny zipper. It's also on the brass and then you get the first 
like the one in the back it's probably the biggest i feel the biggest compartment no not really so you get that one and then you get a second one whoops right there this is the biggest one the one closer and then you have of course the little the little just pocket i think this would be just like to put in receipts or something because there's really not much that can fit the purse it's very itself small. is pretty small i mean you can see it right here next to me but even though it's small it carries all my essentials and a lot of the times I want to carry with me my vlogging camera because I do vlog a lot and I found that it fits really nicely in this bag without the external protector that I have for the bag for the camera. I'll show it in a minute but that was something that I really liked because I did also went in store to see the Willis 18 and that was so small, so tiny. There was no way any of my things were gonna fit. So my camera was a no-no. So whenever I got this, that was the first thing that I did. Like I wanna see if my camera fits and it absolutely did. So now let's go ahead and pack this bag so you can see how, you know, what I have, you know, so you can get a better idea of what would fit. Before we get onto what fits on my tabby top handle, I wanted to show you real quick next to that tabby 26, which is the only other uh, tabby that I own. So here they are next to each other, so side by side. This one, of course, is gonna be taller, and that tabby 26 is gonna be longer. And then there they are next to each other. So you can see how that tabby uh, top handle is more kind of like wider on the bottom so you can definitely I feel like I can fit more in this one than what I can fit in my tabby 26 so yeah these are kind of like I guess in the same family <laughs> if that makes sense so I just wanted to share that with you what I do love about this one that I don't particularly like as much about this one is the side back pocket because here my phone fits beautifully and comfortably in the back and on this one, I just don't like how it looks. But, you know, if I don't have any other option, I'm just going to have to put it in there. But now let's move into putting everything in the bag. So here is my little vlogging camera, which it would never fit with this little bag. So just by itself, the camera, I'm going to go ahead and stick it in the bigger one, which is going to be the first one and it fits very very comfortably up next we have my card holder which i don't really now ever carry wallets i just carry the card holder and this one i'm going to try to see if it fits in that back zipper just to be a little extra careful with it and no it does not fit it's like a teeny tiny pocket like i don't see what anything would fit in there so no so I'm just going to go ahead and stick it on the back. So right behind the camera, you can see, whoops, you can see it right there. And then another thing that I would carry with me would be, of course, my chapstick, which is, this is a bird's piece. I'll put it next to the card holder. And then I also would carry my hand sanitizer. I'll show you how everything looks a little bit, you know, more organized in a minute just because I have kind of like, it's hard to be showing you how I'm putting them. Then I would always carry whatever lipstick I'm wearing, so a chapstick and a lipstick. And this is all going to be in the back next to the card holder. And next I'm going to stick in my keys because my keys are pretty big. I have a huge keychain. I'm gonna go ahead and stick those in there as well. Let me show you how everything is looking. I'm kind of like struggling here. Okay, so here's how everything is looking. The bag has my card holder, chapstick, hand sanitizer, lipstick, and the keys. I always like to keep my keychain like this, kind of like on the outside so I can kind of like grab it faster. Then we are going to have a very hard thing to put in. This is going to be my Advil that I always take with me. But it does fit very comfortably. So I'm happy with that. And just an extra that I would also carry sometimes would be a little mirror. So I've got here like a little mirror that has a like a little sleeve so i would put this also where the card holder is actually i'm going to use yeah behind the card holder i'll stick it up there 
my mask is gonna go on top of my camera and then lastly I always like to carry a pen which is also going to fit kind of kind of hard to get everything in there but let me show you so everything is now inside of my purse everything that I would normally carry I am missing my straw which is something that I always like to carry with me so it will fit if I put it on top of the uh, of the pill box or whatever so here is everything I was actually able to stick everything in my purse and my phone would have no other place but to go in the back very kind of like awkwardly I don't particularly like that I'm not gonna lie but if I want to carry everything that I have inside if I were not like if I'm not taking my my camera with me that would definitely fit this purse would fit my phone inside of it so yeah let me show you now how everything is looking very packed so I was able to get everything in so first let's take off my mask and then you can see in there my camera I hope the camera can see it but the camera is right there and then we've got the uh, straw my pen right here and then that's the little box of the Advil I went on to put the um, strap so the long strap just so you can see how you can actually also carry it I'm gonna move this for a second you can actually carry it like your you know on your shoulder like that that's something that I would definitely do or you can do it as a crossbody which in some purses I do like crossbody but not with this purse. I feel like this purse looks just a little more classy and a little more sophisticated. Just like, I don't know, like I wouldn't consider this like a casual purse, if that makes sense. So for this reason, I much rather have my purse carrying it like this or like this, just on my hand, rather than the crossbody. But you obviously have the option. I much rather carry it like that, but if I'm gonna use the strap, I would just go and use it like that instead. So just kind of like carrying it on the side. So anyway, you guys, this is going to be everything for today. Just wanted to share with you this beautiful new purse, which it's not new, but it is new to me, which makes me absolutely happy. It is a beautiful, beautiful purse, and I cannot wait to use it a little bit more. I have already used it once, and it was so beautiful. I feel like it just elevates so much your outfit. Like always, if you did like this video, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up, and be sure to subscribe to my channel before you leave if you would like to see any more of my content, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!